I say it out of love, daughter. This path, it is not to be taken lightly. If... If I was scared, that would be alright, wouldn't it? Not that I am. It's just that... I mean... It is normal to feel scared. It is? Yes. So use it to make yourself more focused and less reckless in battle. I must admit... I do feel a little scared, but I will be stronger for it. We don't have long. Before you leave, I promised you. The tattoo! I am ready, Papa. <laughs> I know you are. Your first tattoo marks you as a warrior in training. You will add many as your journey continues. Relax, daughter. It will not take long. Huh? Hmm? Huh? Mount Kylos. Your mother and I had our soul union there. I don't ever want a soul union. Never. Ever. I will become a great warrior on my own. I'm not like the other scouts. Talking as if they're already warriors. Standing with others makes you stronger. There is much you can gain by having someone at your side. Like you and Mama. Yes. She is much tougher than you. <clears throat> you are doing very well. I remember my first. ...and how much it hurt. Papa, there's so little time... ...and sometimes I feel like there's still so much to ask you. What is it you wish to know? What if... ...what if I face an opponent who cannot be beaten? I am strong, but... ...I am small. You already know this answer. Never surrender! It is our way. Yes. If I fall, it will be with my sword in hand. And what if... <clears throat> what will you do if I return more powerful than even you? My legend spreading across the valleys. Then I will be more proud than my simple words can express. It is done. It is us. There is one last test you must pass before you can leave. Conquering the unknown. It's too far. I, I can't see what's down there. You must jump. Unless you wish to wait another year. No! I'm ready! Like you said. It's normal to feel scared. I... I can't do it. You have to help me, Papa. Wait! Just um, a second. Jeez. This is the decision I she must make herself. In order for her to do it, she has I to do it by ready. herself. Uh, you are not ready. At least I get to spend another season with you. Even though I let you down. That is not possible. I am proud of you, no matter what you do. Thank you, Papa. 
I will be stronger for you. Papa, we should go home now. You have to let me go sometime. <laughs> you can't hold on to me forever. I get it. You're gonna miss me when I'm gone. Okay, okay. I will miss you too, and Mama. We can't wait around all day like this. It'll be dark soon. I'm gonna see what's happening. What's gonna happen? I'll fight my way out of it if I have to. Out of our heads, trophy earned. I never should have let her go. Maybe, maybe then she would still be alive. Drax, I. Hey, that's real sad and all, but we can use some muscle over here! Go oh, shooty shooty. Ah, oh, never yeah, mind. mind. We're good. Oh, that's a big one. This is where we run. I agree. Why are you stopping? I'm sorry I used my powers on you before. I didn't mean to. It wasn't intentional. I was only trying to pull him off you. What are you talking about? You got us out of there. If it wasn't for you, I'd still be getting squeezed to death by Drax. Oh, you're right. I was the hero. The ship! There's my girl! Hurry, Rocket! I'm trying! I ain't got long stick legs like the rest of you! <laughs> Everyone take a seat! We're leaving! Did any of you get a good look at that thing? <laughs> what was that even? I am Groot. A tree? Mm. Stop yanking my tail! It's giant and terrifying and probably wants us dead. I don't need to know any more about it. In this that. case, I'll say your extreme lack of curiosity is a virtue, Quill. <laughs> Nebula's plugged into the ship. She's stable. Okay, then we're good to go. Wait! I feel something. Someone is... starving. Oh, that's not good. No, bigger! <laughs> My hunger has no equal. <laughs> ah, once we're out of here, we'll get you some food. That is one Big Blue! Yes, Big Blue is a perfect name for this beast. Punch it, Pete! Gonna have to travel twice. Not today! <laughs> Everyone, hold on! So close, I don't know. Yikes. Of course you ate us. Great. And um, someone's lunch. <sighs> Are we dead? Uh, not quite. We're lunch or dinner. What time is it? <laughs> this slimy cave. 
It is. A big ol' stomach. Nebula. Look at I... What the hell is she doing? Gamora, wait! Plug her back in, Peter. No. Stop. Please. If your systems shut down, we can power them through the ship. It won't do anything. Stop being so stubborn. It can help keep you alive. I don't like... being tethered. No. I'm past that point. Don't be stupid. Please. God damn it, Quill. He's trying to help, Nebula. We can't do anything on our own. I'll get Rocket. There's no use. Can't be put back together. This time. Honestly... Feels good to have parts of me. This very. Wish I could have done this whenever I wanted. We're gonna get you help, okay? Rocket can fix anything. Not this time. Cascading system failures. The cybernetic parts of me are going dark. Organics will go offline much quicker. It was my idea to put all this in my body. I told everyone it was so I could be better than Gamora. Why did you really do it? To be more like her. I looked up to her. I was terrible to her. I nearly killed her. I... loved her. You should tell her exactly how you feel. You have no idea how happy that would make her. You think so? I can't, I can't. Not after everything that happened. I'm a living reminder of her time with Thanos. She can't move on until that last... that last piece of him is gone. Things will be better soon. For everyone. Look, this might sound corny, but it's never too late to make things right. You can always make a change. Yeah. Maybe you're right. Thank you, Peter, for listening to us. <laughs> Whatever it is, I'll tell her what you said. I've been afraid of how she might react for so long, but I'm already dying. <laughs> What's the worst that could happen? Hey. Hey. Do, uh... Do you want me to... I don't know people... <laughs> trying to fix me. I, uh... Yeah. I get that. There's something I need to tell you, sister. What is it? I... Uh, 